Hi, my name is Michael Larshevek. I'm a senior technical recruiter with Robert Half Technology. We're a nationwide specialized IT staffing firm that helps all levels of technical employees, whether entry level, a couple years of experience, up to seasoned veterans within the field, gain more experience via contract, contract to hire, and direct hire positions within the IT field. We're working with Southern New Hampshire University to help give you a little bit more information to help out on your job search. And now that you've begun to plan your career road trip, we're here to help you explore your destination along the way. And so some great things to keep in mind while you're looking for some internship experience or just project experience. And one of those is how to make an application stand out. Some of the things that help an application stand out to me as a technical recruiter are the position has very specific details and you want to make sure to tailor your resume and your application to meet those details. So looking through the job description, doing some research on LinkedIn or Glassdoor to give you more insight about a company helps you to match your experience and your education to what an employer is looking for. So make sure to detail specific contributions that will show the employer that you have the experience they're looking for, whether it's hardware or software you've used that relate to their environment, or maybe it's just some experience within a typical field. Maybe you've had a healthcare position in the past and you'd like to work for another healthcare organization. Any type of experience like that that you're able to relate to a position will help an employer see you already in their position. Make sure to be concise. Showing an employer your skills is a great thing, but not if they have to read through five or six pages of detail. Make sure to stay within one or two pages to show an employer that you've got a relevant skill set, but make sure not to bore them by having to go through a whole novel of details. And you can have your career services department at Southern New Hampshire University help you with this, maybe a friend or a colleague, and definitely feel free to reach out to a recruiter like myself. I look at resumes day in, day out, and I always have a great idea what an employer would be looking for for a specific position. Now it's important for students to gain internship or some experience before graduating. We've seen time and time again that candidates that have already gotten some internship experience before graduating have a much higher chance of getting a position after graduation. It's sort of the famous catch-22 phrase where an employer is looking for someone entry level, but they want one to two years of experience already. And the way candidates get that experience is to get internships, to get project-based work, and that way an employer can see you've already been hands-on within the field as well as your education. And one of the best ways to get those projects is to start building your network. So being able to have these internship experiences, you need to start building that network so that way you're able to get more opportunities in front of you. And these internships are always going to give you more experience in different environments, whether it's a small organization with five to 10 employees or a global corporation with thousands of users. Having different environments under your belt will help you know which is a better environment for you going forward in your career. Now, my best piece of advice for incoming freshmen really would be to network. And I know people say it all the time, but it really is all about who you know. And you can do this online on social media like LinkedIn or Facebook and offline at career services events put on through Southern New Hampshire University, job fairs, alumni events, basically anything to put you in contact with people in your desired field will help you start building those personal and professional connections that can give you a real leg up on other candidates going forward. So make sure to go to industry events, make sure to talk to as many people as you can, and really try to add value to each conversation. Everyone else at a networking event is also looking to gain value out of someone, but you have to make sure that you know it's a two-way street. So if you can help someone, whether it's giving them resume advice, getting them connected with someone else that you know, that's always gonna be a great piece of advice in terms of going forward. So if you can help someone, they're much more likely to help you going forward as well. So make sure to give back as much as you receive in terms of that networking. And now there's so much more that Southern New Hampshire University can offer you. So make sure to check out more of the career tools and resources for smooth sailing along your exciting journey. And we hope to see you soon. Thank you very much.